Hi Taurus, welcome to your reading. This is a general love reading, so it may or may not resonate with all of you. At the end of this video, if you are interested, I will also record and extend it to know more specific details on their feelings and intentions for you at this moment. Now let's start with the reading and let's shuffle four times. So let's see about what happened in the past, the challenges, problems with commitment, maybe you were dealing with another earth sign, maybe a Taurus, Capricorn or Virgo or a Scorpio. <coughs> it seems like, uh, it feels like the connection has ended completely, like it is a closed chapter because it lacked the stability that at least one partner wanted there. There's this idea, one person wants to express emotions, feelings or an apology, the other person is being guarded, cold, distant and not trusting the other partner as much. What is affecting you in your subconscious that you may not be aware of? The fact that you still feel confused, a lot in your head, overthinking and not knowing what solution to give to that past situation or it seems like uh, that was a complex problem without any solution. Now, how do you view the situation? You want things to be fair, balanced, harmonious. It seems like it was not like that. Maybe it was a one-sided connection. And uh, your, your focus is to be focusing on a connection that is not superficial, that, uh, uh, that has the potential to be long-term, long-lasting, and... Uh, to provide you that stability that you want in a connection. Some of you were married to this person and then you divorced or it had the potential to be a long-lasting connection it, uh, from the outside. It may have seemed uh, like a very good, stable relationship, but it lacked that foundation, that stability. Now, your hope is uh, at least to have some conversation with this past person and as soon as possible, you are not waiting anymore. You want to hear from them. Let's see about the, the overall energy. It is you wanting to find happiness again. You wanting to be more independent and to find the joy in being in a connection, uh, the joy in dating or being more optimistic about dating again or finding a new better partner. Let's see what is happening with this person. They have the world card. Let's see why the world card. They want to see success in that connection. Here it is, Queen of Swords. They are appearing cold and detached because they fear the drama in the connection. But uh, deep inside, they want to collaborate and start again because here they are wanting to come forward you as prince or princess charming. The connection may have been toxic with them. The problem is that they are a bit impatient. Uh, uh, they have a temper. Uh, they get angry easily, and uh, but they want uh, to see success in that connection again. Here it is, the world card, or at least to find that closure that is uh, needed. Maybe if you didn't have a closure, they want that closure. Uh, will they take any actions? Yes, they want to come towards you. They don't want to be single anymore. Nine of Pentacles in the reverse. The Chariot in the reverse, Three of Cups, King of Pentacles in the reverse, at the bottom is Five of Swords. They want to come back to reconnect and reconcile with you. The problem is they still lack that stability, that commitment. Uh, they want a quick fix, that's, uh, that's how I see it. They want to be in a relationship again with you, but if you both don't talk through all the challenges and differences that were in the connection before and cracked it, 
uh, it is uh, a bit difficult because the charity is in the reverse. The situation feels stuck. You both have different visions for the future together. Uh, this person lacks stability and commitment. Uh, maybe they like to date a lot or let's hope it was not a third party situation. But there are many things that need to be discussed with this person if they came back. Putting the healthy boundaries is very important in this case. So yes, I see them wanting to come back, uh, making some moves towards you. Uh, it may lead to some arguments. And here you will know straightforward, straight away, if uh, this person have changed or not. So if this reunion jumps into conflicts and arguments about the past immediately, this person hasn't changed and maybe not that stable. Uh, anyway, I want to see more details about their feelings. At this moment, how do they view you? Uh, what are their intentions and the energies of the connection? This reading continues in the extended. It is uh, in the description box below this video. And uh, you can find it there. See you at the next reading and bye for now.